my yarn card. <laughs> my name is Ginger. I am the Yarn Geek. And it's almost Christmas. It's like a week till Christmas. And I have not been doing a good job of counting down to Christmas. Because I think the last one I did, it was 16 days till Christmas. And now it is 7 days till Christmas. <laughs> I'm a hot Christmas mess here in Kansas. <laughs> As you can see, um, I must be in my yarn car because my boys are inside doing school and my house is a Christmas mess. <laughs> but I wanted to hop on here and say hi to you guys because I miss you and uh, show you a couple of things. Oh, I got a bunch of things. Actually, I might have to split this up into two videos because there's so many things to show you. But the first thing I must show you is I took a little trip to a bigger Joann's and a bigger Michael's than I usually go to yesterday. And I found some yarn there that we don't have here in Lawrence. They're new yarn colors. So of course I couldn't go crazy wild. I had to, uh, be very affordably crafty <laughs> to to borrow one of my friends names and here's here's what I need to show you okay for $19.45 I got three things of yarn but wait till you see these three things of yarn one of them is the new Karen Skinny Cakes. One of their new colors. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. This is called Sugared Ube. Am I right? Sugared Ube. Ube Sucre. Ube. A sucarado. <laughs> Do you think they're meaning sugared cube? What's an oob? I don't know. But it sure is party. Look at that. It's got dark purples and light purples and teals. No idea what I'm going to make with this, but whatever it is, is going to be beautiful. Okay, the next one. This one is called sweet mints and it does doesn't that look like sweet mints isn't that beautiful oh my gosh okay okay i gotta read i gotta read the the details on these yarns <gasps> look at those colors so pretty okay this is of course a karen skinny cake it is 8.8 .8 ounces, 795 yards. That's a lot of yards. Okay, 795 yards. It is 100% acrylic and it is a light three and you would want to use a four millimeter hook or a four millimeter needle. Look at these two together. Oh, aren't they pretty? Oh, uh, I'm in love. I'm in love. And what, what was the other yarn I got? Oh, I wanted to get all of these. You know, but somebody must have already come through and wiped out the colors because there weren't very many left of these. But I got one. Oh, look at that. It's just like, it's just like Lion Brand. Mandala tweed tweed stripes and this is a four weight 100% acrylic rose water plum <gasps> look how pretty that is oh my gosh I want to make everything with it and it is uh, let's see do you want to use a five millimeter knitting needle or a five millimeter hook 8.5 ounces, 400 
and four yards. I have a feeling I'm going to need to get every single one of these colors and I'll probably need to order them online because there's none in my stores. <laughs> but $19.45 for these three. I mean, I could spend less and I'd be happier, but I'm pretty happy because when I first went in here, there, they were marked at $9.99 a piece. And I thought, okay, well, if I use the 40% off coupon and the 20% off on the rest, I'll be doing pretty good. But I went up to the front and they were all on sale. Plus I got my teacher discount. So. Yay! That was the first trip. That was Michael's. Now, I went to Joanne's. Spent a little more here. I spent like, let me see if I, oh, it's, I think I spent like 30, $35. It was something like that but I got some amazing yarns, you guys. Okay. This Bernat Velvet, I think, was on sale. I got, okay. I got the Christmas colors. Look at that. Oh my gosh, Christmas colors. I think this, these were like $5.99 a piece. They were either $5.99 or $6.99. Like, seriously, what can be made with this? I don't know. I'm thinking some beautiful stockings. <gasps> this one is called Pine. Doesn't that look like pine? And this one is called... Hello? Red. <laughs> pine and red. Or if you want to get fancy, you could go with a Pinot and Rouge. We'll just go with a Pinot and Rouge. That's what this is. Christmas colors. Okay, the details. It's a bulky five. Bulky five. It's super soft. There are 315 yards. Um, 10.5 ounces. It is Burnett Velvet. Burnett Velvet, and da da da. Did I say 10.5 ounces? Or you'd want to use a 6.5 millimeter knitting needle or a 6.5 millimeter crochet hook. I'm thinking stockings, and let me tell you why. Oops, it's in it's in disarray. Let me tell you why I'm gonna do stockings because. Oh my God. Okay, imagine me saying that in uh, what was her name on Friends, Chandler's girlfriend. I forget. Oh my God. <laughs> this is the first time I've gotten these, you guys. Okay, because I had to use my 50% off coupon for some of this off the hook faux fur. Pretty sure that I could make a cuff for this beautiful stocking out of the faux fur. I've never worked with this before. <gasps> this one's called Husky. Oh, and it's got those little loops. It's got these cute little loops. I don't, I've never worked with the loops before either. This is a whole new, uh, whole new experience. It's, I just can't stop touching it because it is so freaking soft, you guys. It's a seven jumbo. It is, <laughs> I'm so distracted. I am literally so distracted. Look at that. If you guys have never felt this before, it's like the softest, softest plush high-end stuffed animal you would ever have. <sighs> How many yards are there? I have a feeling I'm going to be surprised. Oh, it's 100% polyester. Seven ounces. Seven weight. You'd want to use a... Oh, <laughs> look, it doesn't even have hook or needles. It just has hand. 
that you gotta you gotta have a, a 10 centimeter by 10 centimeter hand. <laughs> how many yards? I wanna know how many yards. It doesn't even say how many yards. This is kill you're killing me, Lion Brand. Killing me. Okay. It says no tools needed and no yardage. I don't care. It's so soft. So, stockings with these little furries. Oh my gosh. And then, you guys, I, of course, had to get the Go For Faux. <laughs> this is not the little loops. Oh my gosh, but it feels exactly the same. Look at that. Good Lord. Good Lord. Let's see. It is called Chinchilla. Hmm. There are 24 yards. <laughs> 24 yards of Chinchilla. <sighs> so I'm going to make a cuff for my stockings with my Chinchilla. 24 yards. 4.2 ounces. You'd want to use a, holy smokes, a 19 millimeter hook. It's, of course, seven jumbo weight. You'd want to use 19 millimeter knitting needles. 100% polyester. Ah, so pretty, so pretty. Okay. So, there's my yarn pulling for this morning. And I'll have to show you the stockings when I'm finished because... Oh, amazing now I did get one more thing there and this is just as soft I mean okay I had to get this these were on sale for they were like half off and normally $14.99 so that means they were you know less than 10 bucks but I got this for my granddaughter look at that it's so, okay and normally I don't go for these things because they're like you know, they're usually a little lighter weight or whatever. Not this. This is just as soft as that chinchilla fur. So I got her a little like, plus it's rolled up like a yarn ball. And this is for my granddaughter, Abigail. She's not a girly girl. If you've seen pictures of her, you've seen she does not do girly girl things. So this is one of the things that Grandma Santa is bringing for her. And of course it has little socks to keep her little feet warm. Okay. Well, that is it for my Joann's and Michael's yard haul. Now, let me tell you, the reason I am out in the car right now is because the boys are inside doing school and I keep thinking I just want to make videos in front of my Christmas tree but there's never time to like get everything set up to do things in front of my Christmas tree the boys are always there so I was like okay it's a week till Christmas if I'm gonna get any videos made I gotta go sit out in my car and as you can see I'm not going anywhere because I'm blocked in by my son's truck <laughs> My life is not my own, <laughs> which, you know, I probably wouldn't be happy if it was because I would just be bored. Uh, <laughs> I'd have a lot more yarn, you guys. I can see, like, Grandma Kitty um, is my future because that's probably how much <laughs> yarn I'll have when all the kids leave the house. My husband does not know what's in store for him. But anyway, oh, <laughs> honey, I love you. Also, um, while I was out here this morning, I made a, we're, we have a promo video. The yarn hookers have a yarn, yarny promo video coming up that Julie is putting, Julie the Whippy Chick is putting together for us. And I videoed, uh, at least I tried to. You guys, when you see the promo video, you're going to think I'm crazy because... I don't think uh, it's hard to do a promo video when you have to read words. So <laughs> I'm 
I'm sure because you know how her editing is that she is going to do an absolutely fabulous job. And uh, all four of us hookers are going to be on the video. And I don't know whenever when it's going to be coming out, but it, it should be coming out soon because um, she's amazing. Also, this week on the Yarn Hookers Live tomorrow at 4 Central Time, we are going to be having kind of a holiday show. Um, it's going to be lots of fun. And I hope you will be there. Bring your favorite holiday beverage. Bring some uh, eggnog, some hot coffee, peppermint. Ooh, peppermint mocha. Something yummy and Christmassy. And uh, we're going to just kind of hang out and have some fun. So, you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. And I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Love you guys. Bye. Hey, hookers, want to have some fun? Every month we will hold a yarny, we will hold a yarny challenge. How do you participate? Well, to participate, share a photo of your entry in a Facebook group. Your name will be entered into a random drawing for a fun prize at the end of the month. Photos may be shared to the weekly live on YouTube for everyone to admire your amazing work. Are you it? I don't think that one was very good.